Hey everybody, it's Ron64 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Liquid Crystal. In the last episode, we fought some guys in their prized Pokemon. And we met our second rival, Pokemon Trainer Zane, who had a Porygon. And we got here to Violet City, where we got an Onyx, named Rocky, that I deposited in the, into the PC. Also, last episode, we got a new member to our team, which I will show you... Poliwag, that I haven't named yet. And now we're going to go through Sprout Tower. Um, for those of you playing Heart Gold and Soul Silver, you have to go through Sprout Tower before you go to the gym. However, in Gold, in gold Silver Crystal and Liquid Crystal, I assume, you cannot, or you can go straight f to the Sprout Tower before the, or to the gym before Sprout Tower. So. And we have an escape rope. That'll be that'll be useful sometimes. We stand guard in this tower. Here we express our gratitude to honor all Pokemon. It's Sage Jujujuju. Um, I don't know what his name is in the actual versions, but yeah. Jujutsu. Pardon my really bad Japanese. You know, whatever his English name is, I will say it right now. Alright, so. Yeah. So, pretty much everyone in here has a bell sprout. There are a few exceptions, but pretty much everyone just has a bell sprout, which is great if you have a Cyndaquil because it's easy to just grind for experience. And I should really be putting Poliwag out because she's at level 3 and I gotta get her leveled up, which I will do right after this. And Jeff grew to level 13. Oh, that didn't work. Alright, well, I'll, I'll just switch them in their places after this battle. So. Jeff grew to level 14. And Sage Jujutsu was defeated. Thank you. I knew it. What? Jeff is evolving. At level 14 in gold, silver, crystal, and liquid crystal, your Cyndaquil slash just regular starter evolves. Jeff evolved into Quill Lava. Now, in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, starters um, evolve at level 16, so. Still got a little way to go, Heart Gold and Soul Silver players, not like me. So, we got an X Accuracy, which I will probably never use in this playthrough. Alright, oh, guess I can get, get away from this guy. Sorry about th <clears throat> Sorry. Sorry about that, a wild Pokemon interrupted me. Um, real quick, I actually am going to fight this guy right here just for the experience, but I won't show it, because it's just another Bellsprout and stuff. Alright, so the only thing worthwhile noting is that um, Poliwag grew to level 8 in that battle, so... Woo! Ah, that hurts. Alright, Jeff grew to level 15, and Poliwag grew to level 9. The Elder's HM lights even pitch black darkness. Nope, Poliwag grew to level 10. So not really worthwhile. Alright, this battle is kind of worth showing, 
I guess, so I'm just gonna show it. Let's see how much you trust your Pokemon. Sage Kojiando. Doesn't he work for Nintendo? Anyway, this guy has a hoot hoot. You're different. All right. So also, Polywag um, knows hypnosis now. I'm going to go for Bubbles because Polywag's only two levels below Hoot Hoot, so um, I guess I am going to switch out after all. Didn't think I would, but all right. So yeah, the only reason to show this guy is because he has because he doesn't have a bell sprout. So other than that, this guy's really not special. So down goes Hoot Hoot. Yes, your trust is real. Alright, now let's go up here. You are indeed skilled as a trainer. As promised, here is your HM. But let me say this, you should treat your Pokemon better. The way you battle is far too harsh. Pokemon are not tools of war. Hmm. He claims to be the elder, but he's weak. It stands to reason. Alright, that's not a bloody nose, thank god. I'd never lose to fools who babble about being nice to Pokemon. I only care about strong Pokemon that can win. I really couldn't care less about weak Pokemon. And so he used an escape rope to get out. And speak of the devil, here's an escape rope right here. Alright. So good of you to come here. Sprout Tower is a place of training. People and Pokemon test their bonds to build a bright future together. I am the final test. Allow me to check the ties between you and your Pokemon. So we have Sage... Trees... Christo. Okay. Um, in Heart Gold and Soul Silver, he's actually the elder, and his name is Lee. Elderly. Yeah, that's not funny whatsoever. It's really just a bad joke that you would hear on a bad Comedy Central thing. Well, no, it wouldn't be on Comedy Central. Comedy Central only has good stuff. Anyway, so. Same story, try just rinse and repeat. This place is thoroughly easy with um with Quillava. And Polywag grew to level eleven. He's going to use Hoot Hoot. Oh boy. Wait, what am I doing? Switch over to Jeff. Alright, just now for the spamming A th festival. Or Z in my case, because I'm using a keyboard. Super Potion! You jerk! You know what? You're not the only one here that can use a potion. And I've got two of them. Foresight, what's that gonna do? Alright, Hoot Hoot is down. 
He's going for a bell sprout. I suddenly just got a stuffed nose for, like, no reason. <sighs> Alright, right here, I just got wrapped, right? Well, I can still attack. Thank you. Unlike Yellow, where rap was freaking nightmare... Alright, Poliwag grew to level 12, that's nice. And Jeff grew to level 16. Ah, excellent. You and your Pokémon should have no problem using this move. Take this Flash HM. So you got HM05 Flash. Flash illuminates even the darkest of all places. Um... I, I think it, in my last Pokemon LP, you were, I was able to use this, but I just didn't, so... I might actually use it in this Let's Play, I'm not sure. So, we use an Escape Rope. Now I'm going to go heal. We're going to take on something else in this episode before we head off. Alrighty. So, now we're just going to come over he here. What the heck? Who are you? Get out of my way! Uh, boy. So, Violet City Pokemon Gym Leader Faulkner. The elegant master of flying Pokemon. Alright, I don't know who that guy was. He wasn't in the original game, so... Now, this place looks awesome for being GBA, so I'm going to do a slight fast forward through these two trainers, so here we go. Well, that didn't take long at all, so time for the gym leader. I'm Faulkner, the Violet Pokemon Gym Leader. People say you can clip flying type Pokemon's wing with a jolt of electricity. I won't allow such insults to bird Pokemon. Bird Pokemon don't exist, only flying Pokemon. I'll show you the real power of my magnificent flying Pokemon, because bird types don't exist. Alright, time for the gym leader music. Alright, he sent out a Poke. A Pidgey, I almost said a Polycon. I don't even know. So, Pidgey, it's your standard flying type. I'm just gonna get that out of the way now. Um, there are better flying types, so... You don't have to use it, but... But it's just a standard flying type. It's alright. Alright, he's using a potion. What you missed? Why are you missing? What the? Why am I, like, having trouble with Faulkner? That ain't right. That ain't right. So Pidgey fainted. Poliwag grew to level 13. Nice. Poliwag learned Water Gun, which is also nice. Alright, he's about to use Pidgeotto. I will definitely change so that Poliwag can get a little more experience. 
Alright, Pidgeotto, the evolved form of Pidgey. It's level 17, so... Ow. Freaking mud slap. Alright, so I'm back after that humiliating defeat. I'm just gonna go full force. Full force. Full force. Yeah. Yay, he's burned! Yes! Oh, yay. Ow. Freaking missed. At least he's burned. Alright, so I went out and bought some potions after I got healed up, so... Super effective bullcrap. I'm calling bullcrap on that. Why do you miss? Oh my gosh, freaking mud slap. Why is mine... Forget it. There we go. That was embarrassing. Leader Faulkner was defeated. Darn, my dad's cherished bird Pokemon. It's not even his own Pokemon. Gosh. So we got the Zephyr Badge. Raises the attack power of Pokemon. Enables Flash. We got TM31. Mud Slap. I guess that could be useful, but I don't know. Call from Professor Elm. Hello, Roland. We discovered something about the egg. My assistant is at the Pokemon Center in Violet City. Could you talk to him? Yeah, but we're going to do that next time on the Legend... Uh, not the Legend. Next time on Pokemon Crist Liquid Crystal, we will be doing that and moving on. So I'll see you guys later in this Realm 64. Signing off. Hello there. My name is Professor Oak. People normally call me the Pokemon Professor. And if you like this video, Cyndaquil and I have some links for you to try. Right here, next to my hand, is a link to a playlist for the, a Let's Play of The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask by the same guy that made this video. Right next to it is a, Su is a Suiku. That will take you to the playlist of, the let's, of this Let's Play. The SR64 will take you to the YouTube channel of the man who created this video, and the bird is for the Twitter account. Thank you and enjoy.